Hey guys, so today I wanted to do what's on my shelves part two and I'm going to show you guys what's on. You guys have probably seen this shelf if you follow me on Instagram. I post this little area here because it's like a lot of Too Faced on there. But to the left and to the right I have those lac, lac shelves I think they're called from Ikea. We have um, a TV and I have more shelves up there. So we're going to go through that today and when you walk in my beauty room to the left is the shelves that we did for what's on my shelves part one. Oh, I have a little Halloween garland up now. You guys didn't see that. Um, but when you come in and you turn this way, that's where we're going to go over today. So I'm going to try and get through this as fast as possible. We are going to... Let me step back just one second to see if I can get everything in the frame. Probably not, but this is what it looks like. Top to bottom there. Alright, so starting at the top on the left side, I have some Victoria's Secret pink puppies that I keep up there because they're cute. I have a PR box that I kept also because it's gold and I have a thing for gold. No gold, it's not my favorite color. Well, I mean, kind of, who doesn't like gold? But you guys know pink is. Um, but I love everything gold. So that box is up there. I have a little glitter sign that says love and a rubber ducky from Saturday Skin. Coming down a shelf, I have some Barbie items, a Barbie mug, a Barbie brush holder, a little candle that was made for me, some brushes, and that whole little section I feel like is like black and pink and matchy matchy. Oh wait, I forgot to give you guys a disclaimer. I have a stalker cat and a stalker dog that are like, why are we locked out? So my puppy is there staring in and my cat's right there eating. But they're right outside the room, so I apologize if you guys hear them because they want to come in. Going down a level, I have this cute tray that I found either Marshalls, Home Goods, TJ Maxx, one of those type of stores. I thought it was cute, and I put some, some fancy perfumes on there. It's not my entire perfume collection, but it's what fits on that tray. And I just propped the box in the back that was like super pretty and glittery to put some more perfumes like higher. Take up more of the shelf. I like to, if you guys haven't noticed, I like to fill every little space that I have. Here, these are actually knobs that broke off of my drawers. And instead of tossing them, I just put them at the end because they were cute. And I had two and they kind of match over there. Going down a level, I have my own personal lash store. This is everything House of Lashes. There's a Tinkerbell lash case there. There's the rose gold case there. And then this is the like LED one that lights up when you open it. And then here, I just used an organizer I had to stock all of my lashes in here. So I can literally just go to them and pull them out. And I have some lash glue here. Then in the back, I even have more lashes on each side of this box. And there's some more back there. I have lashes for days. And going down, I have, again, if you guys follow me on Instagram, I've taken pictures of my Mac Ellie limited edition collection so those are all my mac bullets i'm running out of space so i kind of prop betty boop up there my patrick star ones don't really have a home then i have some of these over here in the corner just hanging out but that is where i like i like the way they look displayed so i haven't put them in like a drawer because i could find a bigger organizer but i like them there so and i actually have these in by allegory organizers and I have one here and I have another back here and I just propped it up with a box so that they go kind of like shh you guys like that shh okay so next level sorry if it's shaky also I'm like trying to squat down 
So here I have a pink spinny tower lipstick holder and I believe the brand actually I don't think this one is Zara. I found this on Amazon. I literally typed in pink spinning lipstick tower and it came up and when I bought it it was like $25 and I was like you cannot beat that so I got it. Um, this actually is from House of Lashes. This is a cute pen. Um, it should be up there with the House of, Lash House of Lashes stuff but I put it there. Sonia Kasia brush holder and some of my favorite brushes by her that I will never use. I wish I bought two sets but um, they're super soft. I love the pink, orange, yellow, the little nude at the bottom. And they're actually soft pink bristles. So, super cute. I won't use them. I have more MAC LE limited edition. I keep saying LE. I hope you guys know LE is limited edition. Um, I have some more MAC limited edition lipsticks. And then I have some Clinique lipsticks back there that were super cute. They have the kisses on them. I got those maybe three or four years ago. And this is like one of my favorite MAC limited edition collections. The MAC Heatherette. So that box is just here on display. And the lipstick was actually up here. I have two from that collection. So they're up there. And then um, I don't know if anything is going to fall if I try to turn this. But yeah, it is. Um, I just have random lipsticks on here. It's not all limited edition. These I got from a company as PR years ago. I'm not even sure what the brand is anymore, but I thought these were really, really cute. And there was exactly four, and there's like little four spots for them. So, so that is that shelf. In the back back there, that's just the box. It's actually a Sonia Kashuk box that the brushes came in, and I like the box a lot. I am a hoarder, guys, a hoarder. So that's just the box for that. Then down here, um, the Wet n Wild Flights of Fantasy box set. And then I also have the Fire Dragon versus Ice Dragon. I didn't have room for these and I thought the boxes were really cute. And you guys will see in a minute, I have two more and I had a perfect spot for those two. But I didn't know Wet n Wild was going to continue making these. So now I don't have space. So I just have the two of them back there. Here on the side, this is actually storage. That's a really cute box that I bought a Victoria's Secret perfume set in. And I was like, it might come in handy one day. So I just propped it there. And then this box here, this long thing here, that is a shelf my husband bought me that I have yet to put on the wall. Um, because it's hard work, man. And I've been lazy. So I'm going to stand up and... Let's see. So here we have the TV that turned off. That's supposed to be on screensaver mode. I don't know what happened there. And then up top I have two shelves that my husband put in for me also. And those are the two what and wow boxes that I was talking about. They have the unicorn one on the left. That one was super cute. And I have it up there. Sorry, I'm trying to like get the TV going at the same time that I'm talking. Doo -doo -doo. It looks really pretty when it was on the screensaver. I don't know why it went off. I'm going to leave it there and see if it comes back. So up there, unicorns. And then I put my Ariel. Um, what is it called? Like makeup book there that's by elf they usually have them at Wal walgreens it's a starbucks mermaid cup and that's the mermaid wet and wild box and i thought that whole shelf looked so cute so that's why i added the cup and the book there so that it can kind of go and that's what i mean when it came out with the other two collections i was like where are those boxes gonna go because they don't actually fit in the next shelf they're too tall and I ran out of room, so they're just down here. And that is to go up to the attic. If you guys were wondering what that is, it's the attic. Then the next shelf, I kind of wanted like all of my beauty books or what they were called. I wanted all of my beauty books to be together. And since they are books, you know, 
books. I decided they should be on a bookshelf kind of thing. So they're all up there. Um, there is a... Uh, so there's a lot of, like, what are those? Villain type of books. So I put all of my villain stuff up there with it. Um, there's the uh, Ursula Cruella de Vil Maleficent. Um, two Zoom Zooms lip balms from Lip Smacker. And then there's a Cruella de Vil mug that I got from the Disney store. And then those are all my Star Wars Zoom Zooms just laying there in front. Um, a Hello Kitty cup with some stuff in there and Betty Boop. I love Betty Boop. It's just another cup. So that is the top. Then I have a TV in my room. I watch all of like YouTube videos in here. It's a smart TV so it has uh, apps and stuff. I love watching. I on repeat like crazy person. I watch Pretty Little Liars over and over. I've probably seen the entire seven, epi seven seasons like about four times. I also watch Friends over and over. I watch... Um, I'm, I watched Riverdale in its entirety, but I want to watch it again. So I think I might swap out. Um, I get live TV on here, et cetera, et cetera. And I love watching YouTube videos on the weekends. I just come in here and I put YouTube on and I'll go back and watch some of Jacqueline Hill's super old videos, Nicole Guerrero's. So needed a TV. And then my husband made me put this post-it over there because he thinks people can see you through the little sensor. He's hilarious. So that's a post-it note covering the little sensor thing. And then this, can, can we just um say this is going to be a judgment-free zone for a minute because I don't want to be judged. These are all empty boxes. Empty two face boxes um but you guys shouldn't judge me because look how pretty they are look how pretty they are like who's gonna throw that away so all empty boxes and then this is even an empty 500 point sephora reward that i redeemed but that was really cute so i kept that too then i have a brush holder here with brushes in it I have some of my Lorac palettes on one of the organizers from For Her Vanity. And then I have this like Lorac I, 20th anniversary. They were celebrating and they came out with like liquid lipsticks and lipsticks. And it was in this the box that all of that is hanging out in is what it came in. And I bought it and I swear I probably have never used these items I'm I'm sure they're so expired but then I just have some more boxes back here that's a juicy couture box with the stripes on it and that's the actual perfume in front I think the perfume looks so cute right there um, here I have a bunch of my bedazzled stuff uh, you guys have seen me post these things on Instagram so these are actually little Vaseline's that my friend Amber Lee did. She has an Instagram. I'm going to try and link everything below. I'm not sure really how to do that. I'm not so good at this editing. That's why I don't edit my videos. But I'm going to try and put something down there. But this is just little Vaselines that I thought were so cute. And obviously refillable because you can just scoop out a Vaseline. These are some more little lip balms that she bedazzled for me. Some Kylie liquid lipsticks that another Instagram account did for me her name is Nikki B makeup and she did those for me and then all of these owls are done by Amber Lee also and the little cute pineapple that's my favorite then I have this glitter sign that says happy that's actually broke right there and I've been meaning a crazy glue but eh, it doesn't really bother me that much and then off to the side this is, I think, like a cake stand or something. It was Tiffany colored. And I got it from Target Dollar Spot for like $5. I don't know why it's called Dollar Spot. Or One Spot, whatever it is. But it was 5 bucks. But I got it. And then I got home and had nowhere to put it. So I have a Scentsy Warmer that's propped up. 
And then these are all unicorns that are bedazzled by Amber. Again, so cute. So I'm going to step back a little bit so you guys can see the full view of that top shelf. And I forgot to mention, that's like a little bookcase that I got. I have no idea where I got it. I've had it for years. Um, as you guys can see, it's brown. And my Ikea lac drawers are white. Everything in my room is white. All my shelving except for this. And when I moved into this room about two, two and a half years ago, I told my husband I wanted to paint it white or get some contact paper. And do you guys see how much stuff is on there? At this point, I'm like, uh, uh I'm over it. It's staying brown unless my husband wants to move everything, which I don't, I wouldn't let him because I don't think anything will go back on the shelf the same way. But, and that's just too much work. He doesn't need to do that for me. So, um, I think it's just going to stay brown. So we're going to go over here now. I'm going to squat down on each side because you guys know I like things to be. Parallel? Is that the word? I don't know. But two of these palette holder organizers from For Her Vanity. And the top two are Too Faced. These are all Too Faced on this side, the little small palettes they have. And I had too many to fit on that one, so I carried them over here. And then these are all Makeup Revolutions. You know how they try and like make the ones that look like the Too Faced chocolate bars? I thought they were really cute and I know they're not Too Faced and everything here is Too Faced but they're like a Too Faced dupe and they're super super pretty so that fills up that. Then I just have some more um, mix of boxes and palettes. The top two are empty boxes but I love the way they look. These are eyeshadow palettes. That's an eyeshadow palette. Empty boxes to fill the gap. More empty boxes to fill the gap. My cat feels like he's in jail. He's like, let me in. He's going to find a way in. I know he is. Um, so next on the middle shelf, these are, I swear these are, hold on. Once you take this down, these are all empty boxes. And then these are the palettes for those empty boxes. So like chocolate gold is there. That's the chocolate one. Milk chocolate, semi chocolate, something like that. White chocolate, the bonbons, the peach, those are all the boxes. Except I didn't have a room when I got gingerbread over here on my rack. So I just stuck him there in front. I might have to reorganize organize this whole section just so he can have a home. But for now, he's hanging out there. And then I also have this, which I get a lot of questions on Instagram whenever I post this. Everyone's like, "What? which one is that? So I guess I'll show you guys. It's the Bonjour Soleil, and it's, um, bronzer palette. So it has the Chocolate Soleil Matte Bronzer, the Sun Bunny Natural Bronzer, and the Sun Snow Bunny Luminous Bronzer, and it comes with, like, a little bronzer brush. So, that's what that is, and he's a little bit wider than the other one, so he goes there in the corner. Then I have the empty box, the peach glow empty boxes. I have a, two of these lipsticks, but the other one came in that set with the little puff that I haven't opened yet. So this guy's hanging out by himself. I love the little peach detail in here. Um, but I, I honestly want to get all of those lipsticks because they're so cute. Have you? Let's show you guys the inside. Look at the peaches on here. They have peaches on the lipstick. And it has a TF for Too Faced. So I'm like, when they first came out with these, I was like, who makes a lipstick so cute? How am I going to use it? And I wasn't planning on ever using them. But now I'm kind of like, it's a really pretty color. Over here, I have a, this was a vase. And I had someone make me decals so it just says you know how that thing goes like wwjd what would jesus do this says what would audrey do audrey hepburn and my favorite actress of all time 
So in here, I just use it as like a lippy holder. Um, it holds a lot of my Victoria's Secret mats. My Too Faced, because this is like my Too Faced section. Those are like those sweet oils, etc., etc. These are the cutest boxes ever. These were those heart, um, the black heart bronzers. The Ross and Rachel and Carrie and Big. I love those. And I love Friends, so those are there. And then the Pumpkin Spice palette is... It's not a, a obnoxiously large, but it is large, and I have nowhere to put it, so I just slide it right in there, and that is that shelf there. So it's mostly like palettes. Then the last shelf is so random. Um, cute boxes. I love bowls. Those are two more EOSs that um, my friend Amber did. That's the Love Flush blush palette just hanging out there I kind of prop it out so if I want to use it I just pull it there and I don't have any trouble these are two I, th I think these are both holiday but it's just a little when you open those palettes were in here but the palettes aren't in here anymore I pulled them all out and I think they came with better than sex minis which I had bedazzled one and I said every time I get a new better than sex i'm gonna change the wand to the bedazzle one yeah that hasn't happened so those are just old ones they're super expired i don't use them anymore they're just there for decoration and just like i have the two boxes over here these are two more like from another year holiday stuff and i thought those were so cute and that's the meadow i want candy candy johnson collaboration that's the actual eyeshadow palette so, and this purple rug does not go here. I just thought it would be cute for the video. So, I threw it in front. And so, we went through this entire top, the TV, and that shelf. So, now, lastly, we have this little lack drawer. And we will be done. So, up here, I have my dirty vents that my husband painted pink. Um, most of everything is painted pink, like my light switch cover, which is right here, I can show you guys, is pink. Um, and the other vents in the room are pink too. Um, I wanted like pink details when he painted everything, uh, everything else is white. So that again is a box from Moda. They send me brushes from time to time and I like their boxes. There's a cute Victoria's Secret makeup bag that's just hanging out. Then here I have a, that's actually a candle holder with a unicorn mug on it. I have some cute unicorn stuffed animal guys from Walmart. A cute Too Faced box and those unicorn hard blushes. This is like my little unicorn section and a unicorn cupcake and that's a decoration too. Then here I have a really pretty brush holder made by Glam Obsession, Glam Beauty Obsession. I'll link it below. I forget her username, but it says Queen of Everything Pretty. That's me. And then I have all of these cute golden pink brushes in here. And back there is actually the pumpkin spice, that whole set that I did an unboxing of from HSN. That's the box back there. It was pink and it was cute, so I kept it. And this is an acrylic. I believe I got this on Amazon. I literally just typed in um, brush holders. And I ordered the pink beads because the one that I was looking at came with white. And you can order different color beads, so I got pink ones. And I just have my pretty rose brushes in there. I have that cute Too Faced brush just laying on top. And Mickey and Minnie Zoom Zooms. I don't know if I'm saying those right. Zoom Zooms? Tum Sums? I'm not sure. Um, this is a little like decorate decorative cupcake that a friend made. Then you go down. So these three palettes here. One, two, and three gingerbread cookie, peppermint mocha, eggnog latte. Those were the ones that I was saying come in here. I think they were in the grand 
hotel cafe set that I pulled out. So that's what those are. And then the new sugar cookie palette that came, I thought it kind of went with that flow. So I just set it right there. And then since it's gingerbread and gingerbread's there and it's all like cafe food stuff, I stuck the box to my liquid lipstick there. I thought it looked cute on the shelf. Then this super cute cupcake is from um, For Her Vanity, Martha. She made those too. I think it was like the sweets collection. And you can put whatever you want in there. Um, I have brushes, just random brushes. These are all from the Moda. It's Royal and Langnickel and Moda. They're like the same company. Those are all brushes by them. And someone sent me this cute lollipop that I can see is cracked now. But it was really cute. And this is like all sweet, so I put that there. And then I have um, a macaroon that's bedazzled. It has my name on there. This is not a bedazzled EOS, but I bought it because of the color. I really like it. That is done by Amber. Um, these are just some cute heart shape. I got these off of probably Amazon. Super cheap too. And they're cute. I don't use them. I plan on using stuff when I buy it, but then it never happens. And then this is like a rose. That has glitter and stuff on there. I think it's cute. And then another bedazzled unicorn. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm getting like out of breath. So the next shelf, I got this at Home Goods for sure. This is just a spinny little glass thing. I thought that was so cute. So I just put all kinds of miscellaneous brushes in there. Um, and it's hitting something in the back. So that's a brush holder. This is like all zoom zooms. Sometimes you guys know forever 21 macaroon lip glosses. And there's a, my little pony Pez thing back there just hanging out. And this is almost the second shelf from the, or this is the second shelf from the bottom. Hey, Donna. So here is a brush holder that Makeup Madness, aka Glitter Madness, aka Susie on Instagram made. It says be beautiful. And it has some cute rose brushes in there. And then this is like home of like Zoom Zoom Land. So I had ran out of space on my cute little thing. So then that's how they started going all over the room. Like that shelf and then all the way up there. So this is where they originated. And I finally just got Jack. I didn't have Jack. I had, what's your name? Sally? And Jack was missing. So now I have Jack. And the last shelf... This is a Betsy Johnson tissue box that I put some fake flowers in, and it's just there. It's nothing fancy. It's just taking up some space. And then in this corner, I like, these are my storage corners on the side. This is SL Miss Glam. That's Stephanie on Instagram. She makes her own brushes and stuff. Super cute. And that's her pink brush book. It's like one of the first ones she did. Um, so that's from her and I know she's not watching, but she just had twins. So congrats, Stephanie. And here, oops, oh, zoom, zoom down. I'm going to pick him up. Hold on guys. I don't like my little guys falling. All right. We're back in business. This is just a makeup bag. Had no space for it. And back there is my Mac Oh, let me grab it. The Mac Holiday from last year. The little lipsticks. Which, they're so sad that they're just like pushed back there. But, you guys see, hold on. You guys see the size of that? I have no room for something like that big. And I was going to take the lipsticks out and put them somewhere so that I can use them. And then just find a spot for this box. But that hasn't happened yet. So, for now... He sits right there. 
and he was visible and so I went and added this makeup bag and now I forget that it's back there then in the corner you guys see my cat's food and water bowl there's the lemon edition rose gold and gold mini mickey and then I have oh, I have some selena brush holders and brushes and then I have this Max Selena bag that my friend Iris on Instagram, um, she sent me because I wanted that bag so bad and she was so sweet. She's like, I have more. She's like, give me your address. So she sent it to me. So thank you, Iris. And the bag was taller than I thought. So I didn't really have room for it. So I just made a little Selena corner over there and going up, I have a random YSL bag because it's my first time actually getting a YSL lipstick and I was like I'm saving this bag that's a fancy bag so I just stuck it there so trying to back up as far as I can that is my little shelving on this side you guys have already seen that like I said before and then if you continue going that way you'll see I have a closet we still need to tackle those shelves that are over there and then when you turn that way that is oh more decoration that's my vanity that you guys have seen when you turn that way and then turn one more time and that's my actual vanity where I get ready in the morning so we still have a lot to do in here and more videos to come so I hope you guys like it like I said Again, sorry I'm not a professional editor or anything. I'm going to try and link everything below. And if you guys can think of anything, ask questions. If I forgot anything, I do read the comments. And I try to reply when I can. But I have like my Instagram page to kind of manage. I have actually two Instagram pages. I'm on the keto diet. So I have a keto page. And then I have my regular beauty page. And then I have this now. So it's a lot to manage. Plus I work Monday through Friday. So and I work like 10 hours. So I try. I try. I hope you guys never think that I am rude or not like replying to you guys purposely. Because that's not it at all. It's just super busy life. Um, and then I have these pets that I come home to who want attention and you guys only ever see these two, my cat and my poodle. But I have a German Shepherd. He stays downstairs. So he's he's kind of like more calm. He just hangs out by the patio. So after I get off of here, I'm going to go downstairs and hang out with them. And my husband's on his way home from work. And got to get dinner started. So like I said, leave me any questions, comments below. I'll try and answer what I can. I'm going to probably upload this tonight, hopefully. But it's hard for me to actually attach links to stuff that I bought on my phone. So tomorrow when I'm at work and using a desktop computer, I'll probably insert the links tomorrow. So if you look tonight and there's nothing down in the description, check back again tomorrow and hopefully everything's there. And if I don't link something tomorrow that you wanted to know where it was from, just let me know and I'll uh, either send send you the link on Instagram if you're following me there or I'll try and try and remember to edit it and relink it. So, I hope you guys like this. Give me a thumbs up, please. And thank you for watching. Love you guys. See you next time.